What's wrong? Oh, Larry, I'm like so mad right now. I don't know what to do. Sucks to be you, but come on, what am I, your shrink? It's my boyfriend, Larry. Or should I say ex-boyfriend? That total a-hole. So it turns out that call I got the other day was like a total prank. Ugh, whatever. Anyway, so I confront Chet about it, and I catch him in bed with Estelle Barfus. Ugh, Estelle Barfus? Yuck. Like, it is so over. Barbara, Joe, you sound angry. After we're done here, I want you to draw a poster or a picture that can remind you how to deal with your anger and put it up in a place where you can see it. If you need to, lay your head on my shoulder. Talk to me. Thanks, Larry, but I so do not want to talk about it right now. And no offense, Larry, but especially not with you. Check this out. I stole it from the children's rec center. Hmm, Barbara Joe, you're looking all hot and bothered. Why don't you bend over and Timmy will make it all better. Uh, you cannot be serious. I know what you're thinking. I want Larry. I need him. I need him inside me. No, stop. Count to ten, take a deep breath, <gasps> or walk away until you've calmed down. Yeah, Timmy, whatever. Barbara Joe is one horny cock slut. Just like your mother. Hey, we could read her a story from Penthouse Forum. If I was anything else, I'd be the water in your bath. Ooh, a story, fun. I can tell by looking at you, you need it real bad. What's your story? I caught Eunice playing with Max's magic sticks. Can you blame him? Have you ever seen Eunice? Oh my god, I used to totally play that game. Magic sticks was like so fun. But Max is my one and only. I'm gonna be the best friend you ever had, bitch. Why don't you come and have a lick on my tip? Will you tie me up and blindfold me? I'll do anything you desire, Barbara Jo. Yippee skippy, let's do it. Larry, should we go ask the teacher for sticks? I got a magic stick in my pants, oh yeah. Right there! Don't stop! Um, I think I'll leave you three alone.